classification of a polynomials. Polynomials will be classified in two ways. First one based on the degree of a polynomial, second one based on the number of a terms that is the first one is based on degree of a polynomial, degree of a polynomial. Second one is based on number of terms of a polynomial. Now, based on a degree of a polynomial, there are four types of a polynomials are there. We will discuss one by one. Let us see the first one. The first polynomial based on a degree of a polynomial is linear polynomial, linear polynomial. Linear polynomial means a polynomial whose degree is 1 is called as a linear polynomial or it can also be stated as a polynomial in which the highest power of the variable is 1 then the polynomial is called as a linear polynomial. Example 3 plus x 4 x minus 5 these are the examples of a linear polynomial. Then moving to the second one that is quadratic polynomial, quadratic polynomial. Quadratic polynomial means a polynomial whose degree is 2 is called as a quadratic polynomial or it can also be stated as a quadratic polynomial means a polynomial in which the degree of a variable is or that is the highest power of the variable is 2 then the polynomial is called as a quadratic polynomial. Example 3x square plus 4x plus 5u or 4x square minus 5u is also an example of a quadratic polynomial. Look at here, here the degree of the, the highest power of the variable is 2, therefore the degree of this polynomial is 2, then this polynomial is called as a quadratic polynomial. Here also the highest power of the variable is 2, therefore it is called as a quadratic polynomial. Then moving to the third type of a polynomial that is cubic polynomial, cubic polynomial. Cubic polynomial means the name itself give the meaning that is cube means 3 that is the meaning of a cubic polynomial is a polynomial whose degree is 3 or a polynomial in which the highest power of the variable is 3 then the polynomial is called as a cubic polynomial. Example 3 x to the power 3 2 x square 4 x minus 5 is an example of a cubic polynomial. Look at this example. Here the power of the variable x is 3, here it is 2, here it is 1. Among 3 to 1, the highest one is a 3. Therefore, the degree of the polynomial is 3, then it is called as a cubic polynomial. If you want to write another example for cubic polynomial, you can write in, in only one that, that is 4x cube plus 4x minus 1 is also example of a cubic polynomial. Then moving to the last and the fourth one that is a biquadratic polynomial, biquadratic polynomial. Biquadratic polynomial means a polynomial whose degree is 4 is called as a biquadratic polynomial. It can also be stated as a polynomial in which the highest power of the variable is 4 then the polynomial is called as a biquadratic polynomial. Example 4 to the power 4 minus 3x cube minus 4x plus 5u is an example of a biquadratic polynomial. Let us explain the example. Here the power of the variable x is 4, here it is 3, here it is 1. Among 1, 3, 4 the highest one is a Four, therefore, the degree of the polynomial is 4, then when the degree of the polynomial is 4, then the polynomial is called as a biquadratic polynomial. This is regarding the 
that is types of a polynomials based on the degree of a polynomial that is based on the degree of a polynomial there are four types of a polynomials are there the first one is linear polynomial quadratic polynomial cubic polynomial biquadratic polynomial linear polynomial means degree of a polynomial must be 1 degree of the polynomial should be 2 for a quadratic and degree of the polynomial should be 3 for a cubic polynomial and the degree of the polynomial should be 4 for a biquadratic polynomial now moving to the types of a polynomials based on a number of a terms based on a number of terms there are three main types of a polynomials are there the first one is a monomial monomial that is monomial means a polynomial in which only one term is there then the polynomial is called as a monomial example 4x 5x etc are the examples of a monomial you can write a uh, example with uh, another variable also it is not necessary or compulsory that we need to use only x as a variable you can use any alphabet from a to z as a variable in the polynomial no problem now moving to the next type of a polynomial that is binomial 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 means uh, a polynomial in which only two terms are there then the polynomial is called as a binomial example 4x plus 5 3y minus 3 are examples of a binomial here the there are two terms are there one is 4x another one is 5 there are two therefore it is a binomial here the first term is a 3x 3y second one is a 3 two terms therefore it is a binomial moving to the third one and the last one is a that is a trinomial trinomial try try means three that is a polynomial in which or a polynomial which contains three terms is called as a trinomial example 4x square 5x minus 4 here this is a example of a trinomial in which three terms are there first one is a 4x that is a second one is a 5x third one is a 4 this is a it contains it is polynomial contains three terms first one 4x square second one 5x third one minus 4 three terms therefore it is a trinomial so these three are the types of a polynomials based on the number of the terms so this is regarding the classification of a polynomials that is once again i will revise Class polynomials will be classified in a two ways first one on the basis of a degree of a polynomial second one on the basis of a number of a terms on the basis of a degree of a polynomial there are four types of a polynomials are there linear polynomial quadratic polynomial cubic polynomial and biquadratic polynomial and uh, based on a number of a terms there are three types over there first one is a monomial binomial and trinomial monomial means only one term binomial means there must be only two terms trinomial means there must be a uh, three terms along with this one there are few more types of a polynomials are there those are the first one that is another one is zero polynomial zero polynomial means in a polynomial there must be a only one term and that term should be zero then that polynomial is called as a zero polynomial and another one is a constant polynomial constant polynomial means in a polynomial there must be only one term and that term is must be a constant term except zero then that polynomial is called as a constant polynomial so this is regarding the classification of a polynomial so far we have discussed about this is basic terms related to the polynomials once again just i will revise whatever the points we have discussed in a polynomials begins with the variables first we have discussed about a variables then constant algebraic expressions terms fractors then meaning of a polynomial then degree of a polynomial afterwards classification of a polynomials so it is these are the important points which are necessary to know before we going to study about the three main concepts of a chapter polynomial thank you